Whenever you shop online, companies are watching and tracking every click. It's actually a pretty simple technology. It's called a cookie. It's not something you eat. It's a little file. It stores who you are, and it knows where you've been. Privacy expert David Lamb of Private.me says companies use this data for targeted advertising. So when you do find that perfect Valentine's gift, it may find you again on other websites. You don't have to buy anything. All, you don't have to click on anything. All you got to do is go to a web page. Simply viewing that page can trigger an onslaught of ads. If you share a device with your partner, these retargeting ads really could ruin the surprise of your Valentine's Day gift. If you do share a tablet or computer with that special someone, try using an alternative browser. So if you usually use Google Chrome, maybe go to Firefox and do your shopping. You can also go into a browser's settings and clear the cookies and the search history. The other thing you can do is you can go into what's called an incognito mode. That's a private setting that most browsers have to avoid tracking activity. Also, be careful with web pages linked to your store accounts. They'll often suggest items or show recent product views. If you do buy on a site like Amazon, which I visit frequently, just, uh, just make sure you don't go back to that site while your significant other is anywhere nearby. Or just skip the tech altogether for some old-fashioned, in-person, in-store browsing. Mark Barker, NBC News.